and today we got some great progress so what i've done here is made a fully compatible and compact pcb which has all functionalities such as charging as a inbuilt battery for portability of course and i also modified the vmos d1 mini or the esp266 board with an antenna for longer range i've also extended the gpu outputs from the vmos d1's board to the side of the board with also a reset button in the middle of the keypad area to easily reset the device and upload the code there's also on off switch right here which, which is not connected to vmos directly but there's a pass transistor which acts as a very low resistance on off switch so uh, that's all for the exterior part and the build and the back side is almost nothing it's just for protection or safety for charging i've used a tp4056 charging module which is connected to the battery for protection and charging and the vmos d1 mini is below the display i had a very hard time making this work it's like around uh, six hours or some of hard work on this board but finally it's working so the left side keypad is the up down left and right at the right side there's a back and a select button lowermost button which is small is an action button which can be used to perform any other action which an app requires for hardware part that's it and now comes the software part as i showed you in day three there's nothing much to show but yes for the button test thing i've also added another button right so um, for that to check i also updated the code to see if it's working or not and all the buttons are working fine if you did not see all my playthrough or walkthrough videos of making this stuff from start i have created a playlist you can go and check it out there look at this ui over here like this and now comes the fun part that i can make any apps and deploy it on this and use it anywhere wherever i want such as um, penetration testing games or whatever you imagine just which can run on the esp266 it's pretty cool and um, i'll be updating this as far as possible up to perfection or up until the 4mb flash of this runs out and if you want the source code and all the connection diagrams I will give in the next video if any of you comment. Feel free to comment or suggest any improvements on this. So for today that's it. I'll come and meet you in the day 5. Bye bye.